Well, we are, we are done with this area, so yeah, let's continue. Look at you, kid. So you finally got the pure metal. Woohoo! See, that's my enthusiastic woohoo. This is no time to celebrate, as if all of our troubles are over. I won't rest until we find those three pure metals. And we're off to sea. I don't think I've ever, ever run in with a possum outside in the way that some of my neighbors have. Okay, uh... Oh! I know what this is already. And you know what's funny is this... I shouldn't be running into this right now. If I remember correctly, the way this, this ship works is it appears... Only during a particular time of day. Um, and I think because for Animal Crossing I had to change my time. This is the only reason this is happening now. Also, we don't run from her. <laughs> we face her head on. Linebeck, show yourself, ha! Huh? You again. Little boy in green. Any chance you might tell me where Linebeck is? Hmm, didn't think so. Well, I suppose that means I'll have to deal with the two of you in order. And I will start with you. Prepare for punishment. These two belong together, honestly. Not again. I have one last thing to say. I... I hope you're really proud of yourself. Hear me? <laughs> Boy, am I getting sick of seeing her face all the time. Hey, Lankles, here's a tip for you. Hey, Lankles, we're shipping out. Let's put these waters behind us. The reward keeps getting bigger and bigger. This is why I do this. I forget what masked beetles sells, but we'll see. <laughs> there was a there was a video recently um, where this Australian couple is trying to have a barbecue outside, and they go so they go open uh, the lid to their barbecue, and then there's a possum kind of just hanging in the corner there, and. It, they're trying to get the possum out of the barbecue, but the possum just won't go away. It just keeps hissing. <laughs> and that's what was happening outside, only with the bin. Anytime I've run into them, they just... They just look sleepy. So I've never seen one agitated. Ah, oh, hot! Okay. Welcome, I don't think we've met before, nope. But I know all about you. I close up shop in seven days. Liquidation sale. Perfect. I had the courage to purchase the gem. Courageous purchasing. Okay. I think we're good here. So hang on. Uh, dungeon, and then that would mean there's three that I need to find in the world. If I'm not wrong. I know one of them is associated with the mermaid, I can't remember where the other ones are. Money.
Just ignore the pirate ships. Fine, we have money to make. <laughs> Wait, what? Ambush? What is this? You're up, Blankers. We've been boarded by foul monsters. As the commanding officer on this vessel, I order you to remove them at once. I don't think I've ever seen this before. Oh. Was that it? Ha! Did they actually think they had a hope against us? Ridiculous. Say, Lankle, here's a prize for you. Hang on to it. Oh. All right, here we go. Let's put these waters behind us. Okay, worth it. Uh, I'm just trying to think, should I go back to the... I think we have to go back here. First. Because we got to get a chart. I don't know if I could have done this quicker. <laughs> it's not skippable. Alright, it's fine. Okay, uh... Wait, is this the way forward? No, this is the way back. Okay, my bad. It's this way. What? No. Ah, oh, no. What have I done? That was the way forward. Uh oh. Ugh. Hold on. This is so. This should not be this this precise. <laughs> okay. It's okay, no time was wasted. In terms of our glass time. I have to do all this again. <laughs> Crap. 
crap. <laughs> I'm I'm going I'm leaving, I'm coming back. <laughs> I'm not about to start it like that. Yeah. Yes. Just do this. That was a bad start. There's one genre of games I just don't play, and that's stealth. <laughs> and this is why. He took it, he took it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did it? No, 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 relax, 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 relax. This is fine. I remember. Everything's everything's under control. remember how some of this works. Okay, that's ready. Don't worry. Oh yeah. See, I've got new tools now. Wait, what just opened up? Okay. <laughs> okay, I have to put you down just for a minute. What? Gem. 
I don't know if I should restart or not. All that did. <laughs> but I did that myself. process. Did he just take away my 30 seconds? <laughs> Alright! Fuck me then. just needs to be in the area. It doesn't have to be on it. I'm just going to reset it real quick, because then it's further away. This just brought me back here. Wait, 
But don't tell me. What? Did I do something wrong? <laughs> we need a new chart, right? Like, because it, it goes to the... I can't just go there unless I have to go to the formality of... Uh, huh. Maybe I should do it from the start again, as annoying as that might be. I guess the other thing is I might get a better time. I don't know. Alright. I did- I must have missed something minor. I think there's also treasure I can get now as well, so... Okay, yeah, see there. Right there. I'm leaving. I'm coming back in. I'm not- I'm not about to start with, like, a 45 second penalty. I'm just curious if I needed to sail to the ocean or not. Like, I guess the other times I did. Try again. If I reach a dead end, I'll just check. Okay, I shouldn't do it just yet. Now I'll do it. Okay, the shortcuts are... Last time I needed to find a symbol, that, that might be what I need to do. Maybe I'm getting ahead of myself. and I realized that I'm 
supposed to do this. Then this. Then the key drops. Okay, got it. That's what I did wrong. Link, dang! <laughs> Quick. Oh. Okay. I'm doing this one. What? Oh no. <laughs> this is gonna waste time. Hey, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Oh. <laughs> I wanted it to follow me. I was gonna put it down that hole as well, so then I, I don't have to stress anymore. Get that quickly. I genuinely can't tell if I'm doing better or worse. Okay. I mean, I guess it's fine that I'm backtracking just because I'm getting treasure now that I couldn't get before. Oh, see, there's stuff here too. is going. Okay. Ah, oh, what? <laughs> Wait, that works? That's a good way to take him out. Okay, try again. Interesting. This seems to be a much more streamlined way to do it.
Maybe this was for the best. Turn it back on. Yeah. So then I can. There we go. Already up to here. Oh! <laughs> Under control. Okay. Please be correct the first time. Okay, good. <laughs> it took you three fifty eight. Yes, that's a much better time. Okay, saving. I mean, if nothing else, less pressure. Okay. Yeah, much better. So, I guess I shouldn't have gone back. I'm gonna have to do all this again. Ugh, alright. problems here. I just have to be patient. Okay, I think we can go. No, we can't! <laughs> it's coming back. I know optimization wise. I don't have to stress about the triangle. I can just bring the triangle. The triangle's not going to do anything important. silly. Wait, what did I do? Oh, I forgot.
Uh oh. Ah. The other one was coming up. Let's just bring the circle up, because this one's already there. Where does this switch come from? There appears to be a switch I haven't activated. Can't be from the triangle. Is it from the- it might be from the triangle. Shit. I have squandered <laughs> the lead that I got. Oh no, it's that button there, you idiot. Ugh. Okay. I'll take my aggression out on this one. Press the button! That doesn't make up for it. Whoa! Uh oh. No, oh, no, it's fine. <laughs> I don't even know how that happened. To this. Okay. Oh shit. Okay. 
Okay, do not go to go through the blue portal. What did I miss here? There's nothing here. Set the crystals in this order. Square, circle, triangle. Square, circle, triangle. Ah. Okay, square, square, circle, triangle. I should probably write that down. One, two, three. There we go. It feels like something moved outside. HALT! That was a huge tremor. It's like the whole floor sank down. The whole floor sank down? Oh, there we go. Hey, this isn't the same place we came out last time. The temple goes on and on. How many floors are there in this place anyway? Okay. New Reaper. Gold! Just <laughs> please. There are more phantoms. They're not like any we've seen before. Just stay sneaky like always. Yeah. Okay, I see a... I see this. I should still probably take those things out. This is gonna be funny, but watch. I'm not even kidding. Hit it! <laughs> there we go. That's how we do that. Cancel. Alright. It's just to make my life easier later. Okay, there is another one coming up that we should get. Ooh, no, I can't get it. Alright. This what is, what is this? Indiana Jones? <laughs> okay, there's the key. I'm gonna put it here. gonna patrol this area until it gets the kill. Okay, there we go. I just want that to go smoothly. So there is a post across. What is this? There's a button over here. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I was expecting to happen there. I thought maybe invisible lore, but... Eh. because the phantoms around here are slow. 
I had no idea what would happen when they saw me. Okay, now we just wait. I am enjoying this more because I have my, my coke, so I can drink it whilst this is happening. See ya. I still shouldn't take it easy. wanted to be extra certain. Okay, we are perfectly safe now. No need to stress. Completely stress-free environment. What? Oh. I see. Wait. Doesn't that work? What do you have to say? Get out of the way. A treasure chest there of all places. How is anyone supposed to get to it? I need to get on high ground. How do we get up? 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 There. Uh, okay. Thanks. I've missed something minor, what is it? Get this yet, can I? And the only thing I saw was the the shovel thing, but then it didn't look like I could get there from there. Hmm. Just thinking. Was there a slingshot thing maybe I could do? Slingshot, slingshot. Where could I slingshot?
has to be from above. How do we do this? Okay, I'm not moving. Okay, so that brings me here. So see, this doesn't let me get across. Got it. it. It just clicked what it was. Yeah, I thought maybe there's something that lets me fly on the wind, but no. Okay. That probably was not worth the time it took. Go, my friend. I'm making sure that we don't have any security problems. Should probably wait. Or is that stationary? That one looks like it's stationary, okay. Go, my friend. Okay, that side's completely safe. Jeez, that is brutal. It's okay, we're okay. <laughs> Those are scary. Turn the switch on. And it goes out right away. If there was a way to make time, I would be able to cross the bridge. friend. <laughs> this is way more scarier. Didn't have to be that far. Oh! Don't tell me they. <laughs> okay, it's fine. They don't follow you up here. Step on the four switches atop the four platforms. Okay. That was lucky. I 
I don't like this. This is so tense. Oh. Did I just think of like a, a really smart way of doing that? Wait, I don't need the bridge though. I don't need to do that switch thing. I, w I wonder if I should have been here sooner, huh? Okay. <laughs> I think the challenge is gone by having the hook shot, but sure. I don't know why, but I got this feeling like there's a clue up ahead. <laughs> Jeez. I mean, work smarter, not harder. Like. That's an item in the game. doing that. Bomb Chew Patrol. Oh, why? Oh, that would, no, that's bad timing. Can't go now. Jeez. Okay. It's one. Is that open? It's not open. Okay, bomb chew friend. Doesn't reach. Oops. Wait a minute. Ah! <laughs> I almost hit myself. Okay. Realize that at the last possible second. Like, wait a minute. This works. Excuse me, sir. This is worse.
Okay. Bomb. Bomb two. Go. Be quick. Got it. Wait, no, I didn't. It's fine. No pressure. Can't hit that platform, so it's got to be like here, there. All right, so this is. <laughs> ah! Please. Okay, got it. Okay, now we don't have any concerns. This is gonna be the same thing again. Okay. Uh. If I'm guessing, that's probably the best spot to put it. Oh. I did not know you could murder those things. an active button, okay. Going back for that chest, you better believe it. <laughs> Crusty button, I guess. Hey, confirming. Okay. Yeah, no, we're fine. Stab him in the back. Was that, was that really worth my time? Okay. Well. We did it. This is the last chart. It's the northeastern corner. We can travel all the corners of the high seas. Let's go back to the ship. It means I have to go through this ordeal again. Favorite island is coming up. The best Zelda race ever. Okay. Well, since there's no Metro to do tonight, I can keep playing this. And Vampire Survivors, for that matter. Like, I'm done with Vampire Survivors, too. Yeah. 
Just finishing games, achieving goals. <laughs> Samus returns. Maybe not yet. I've been neglecting Animal Crossing. But also, I'm not entirely convinced I'm going to get through these Zelda games before Tears of the Kingdom comes out, so... I pretty much have to go through one a week. So then I have two weeks to finish Breath of the Wild, like, it's kind of nuts. I could do a speed run? No. Well, the problem is, Breath of the Wild, I never streamed it properly. Because I wasn't streaming back then. And then there was the whole thing where I lost internet connection for three months, and then when I got my internet connection back, it was bad, so it was basically a year of bad streams. Well, no, because I got, I got the Switch, and then I hadn't... I wasn't streaming yet. And then when I did get it, it was kind of... I think I streamed a little bit of it, and then I had to move to the city, and then I couldn't stream the rest of it. It was 2017, so... Yeah. I think the only part I did stream was the, the Trial of the Sword part. Or I could drop some. Well, this is what I was saying, is I've, I've already played Skyward Sword, technically. That was the remaster they did two years ago now. So, it's pretty recent. That's the only one that I, I could say that I could be like, alright, listen, in the interest of time, if you want to see me play Skyward Sword, just go watch it on YouTube. It's there. But, I mean, I think I can get through it. Let's, let's just see. The DS games are very short. A Link Between Worlds, I feel like that's something I could just go through very quickly. Skyward Sword is long. It, it is long like Twilight Princess, but I don't think it's it's that long, especially since it's pretty recent in memory. So I think I might be able to uh, to do things a little quicker. What was the symbol for the North Sea? <laughs> I forgot the symbol for the North Sea. Okay, I'm just, I'm just gonna go to the northwest and see. It's fine. This is the problem with this, is like, I've drawn the symbols, but I still have to memorize them because they're not on the map. The reverse end, thank you. As soon as you said it, um, I just have to train myself to do it the other way around. How the heck do you draw a reverse end, anyway? Because this is N, so then the reverse N is... <laughs> I, I, I had to think about that a little bit too much. Okay. I seem quiet compared to the game, really? I haven't changed any volume settings. Or is this because my mic is just further away? Is that better? If I remember correctly, the mermaid is around this island. But I can't remember if it's in this sea or the other sea. We'll go have a little peel on here. I think we would have seen her if it was the sea. I haven't touched the capture volume at all, so I don't know. Let me know.
Yeah, it doesn't look like she's here. Is it okay if you're judging my chef? I mean, I don't know. Like, I just put pieces together that worked. It's not meant to be aesthetically pleasing. What would you have me do? I love how inaccurate that can be, and yet when it came to the Triforce, just absolutely insane in terms of how accurate that had to be. How about I just go there <laughs> instead of doing that? The only explanation is maybe Windows has messed with my my volume setting a bit. I'll tell you what, let me let me do this. Is that uh, that is definitely lower now on the desktop audio side, so. The flaccid palm tree is a vibe. The the palm tree is flaccid? What do you mean, flaccid? It's pointing upwards. It's not flaccid. Flaccid, it'd be going... It'd be pointing downwards. Why am I having this conversation? Like, I hate it. I'm defending the flaccid palm tree, okay. <laughs> How about we just call it the mildly erect palm tree? There you go. Not quite at full mast. Half mast palm tree. I'm sorry, chat. <laughs> That's all I can say sometimes. This ship has big palm tree energy. That's all I'm saying. What on earth? Almost didn't get that. The thing is, these are the pieces that give me stamina, you know? I wish I could do more in terms of aesthetics, but I can't, you know? And I'm not about to go look for more ship parts. Maybe I'm not remembering this correctly, but I swear the mermaid's hanging around the island. Um, Banan tells me where to find her.
I did talk to the dude on Banan, but didn't say anything. Just said wanted to see a mermaid! Can I just go back here for a sec? What is this? sign here. Must hit sign. Hitting sign. I don't think this is anything. <laughs> I'm gonna have one last look around here. What a beautiful... Beautiful sketch I've made. That's the sign for the minigame? Minigame? Generally don't remember that. The ship one. Okay. So is this just where the ship minigame takes place and <laughs> nothing else? Because that's the only thing I haven't resolved is the mermaid thing, and I swear she gives you a heart. Or it ends up in a heart, I just remember. It's important. I might just travel there now. This is if I'm remembering correctly, you know? This could just be a wild goose chase. Let's just... Uh, menu, slate... <laughs> Alright, I'll go to Banan. See what they have to say. Hey, wait, there's boats over there. No, but that's somewhere else. Oh, yeah, we got the post thing now, too. So I guess this is good that I came here as well. Another power gem. Bats. 
What does this say? Look at the stone tablet to the left. Look at the stone tablet to the side. Look at the stone tablet to the right. If you look closely, something scribbled in small letters. I buried something nice between two treasure chests. BRB? All good, all good. Okay. I mean, these these are just shit parts. This is this is the thing. There are certain Zelda games where just I don't open treasure chests because I know that they're never anything exciting. This is one of them, and Breath of the Wild is another. Breath of the Wild is always a weapon. Here it's always a treasure map that leads to a ship part. I don't think you get any heart containers from salvaging. This is a letter from the old Wayfarer. Ahem. Here we go. Have you found yourself on the path of Wayfaring Lankles? Don't fret if you haven't. You may already be on the way and not know it. Yes, finding your way is like discovering a pebble lodged between your toes. No, a true wayfarer can travel the whole world and never find just one way. But I did want to give you something unusual that I've found on my own travels. May it serve as a reminder that you can find anything if you give it enough time. Sincerely yours, the old wayfarer. I already have this! <laughs> how does he... How does he put an entire... An entire cathedral-looking thing inside a mailbox. What do you mean? The mermaid. She is a slight, elusive creature. She will not show herself if monsters lurk by. Uh... Do I... I guess I need a... Are you saying purify the island? <laughs> Don't, please. Special delivery! Watch out, incoming! Are you about to give me a ship part I already have? This is a letter from Salvatore. Salvatore. Ahem, here's what it says. Greetings, Lankles. No doubt you are waiting for a note from me, the master of diversions. So come by again. I mean, if you want. Play a game or two. What? Got better things to do. I'll be waiting. What else am I going to do? I'll be the guy staring out at the sea, bored out of my mind. Sincerely yours, Salvatore. Okay, see, that's a- that's a good- that's a good item to be sending me. And that's the end of it. Got all that, sir? Then I'm out of here. Oh! Where'd you go? Why'd you- Do I need to sneak up? <laughs> Ow! Hey, what are you doing? What's your problem? So I like getting dressed up like a mythical creature. I'm a human being, treat me like one. I'm not some freak you can just throw stuff at. Don't just stand there staring at me, apologize. I'm sorry. Huh. <laughs> As long as you understand that now, that you can't go doing that. Maybe I'm wearing my mer-girl costume, but I'm still me. And isn't this swimsuit cute? I made it myself. Uh, no way. You're saying there's an old wayfarer who thinks I'm a real mermaid? Wow. Well, that's not my problem, you know. Uh, well, I mean, between us, 
I've always thought that Wayfaring Tales were neat. In a high seas adventure kind of way, maybe we're fated to meet. I'm gonna go to that old man's hut and visit him. I hope he raves on and on about the romance of the sea. Thank you. Just smack her on the head and make her come to her senses that she needs to go meet an old man in a stranded hut somewhere on an island. Yeah, that'll- that'll teach him. I did the most Australian thing. To win an argument, I threw a boomerang at someone's head. To change their point of view. Special delivery! This is a letter from Aru of the Anuki. Ahem. Here's the scoop. You, Guy, Lankles, it's me, Aru the Anuki. You took care of me the other day. I gotta say, I was touched. Thanks to you, I got my life back. Literally. My world would have stopped if you hadn't done what you did. I'm sending a small token of my appreciation. I found it at the dump, but maybe you can use it. The real Aru. <laughs> Wisdom. I love how... I love how... The thing that it's hinting at here is like... Just something that was considered a symbol of wisdom was thrown in the trash. What the fuck you want to be smart for? No one wants to be a nerd. Are you a nerd? Throw that thing away. Wisdom ends up in the trash. <laughs> okay, uh, I can erase these things now. The Anouki thing was funny. Have you found her yet, the mermaid? Yes. What? My wayfaring heart is filled with the thrill and romance of adventure. You found the mermaid and she listens... She enjoys listening to the old wayfarer tales. And she said that she'd come visit me one day? Ah. I'm a fool to believe such a wild tale. How could you toy with the hopes of my romantic wayfaring heart? I've been waiting here, but no mermaids fond of tales of wayfaring have come. Or could it be? She must have met another old wayfarer to enchant with her mermaidish song. Hey, Kira, what's up? Mermaidish song. Teehee, did you hear that, Lankles? Another old man? Teehee, you think she's talking about the lazy old guy that drives our ship? Oh no. SPECIAL DELIVERY! Excuse me, I had something in my throat. Special delivery. Now this is a letter from Gongoran or the Gorons. Ahem, <clears throat> listen up. My brother, Goro Lankles. How are you doing? I have decided to work part-time on a southeastern sea isle. Stop by if you are in the area, brother. I'll be the one rolled up in a ball and making a spectacle of myself. P.S. Enjoy the gift. Your brother, Gongoron. I love- I love it. Easy gems. <laughs> love old men. Even like the- the crusty seafaring sea- what is it? Wayfaring kind? Hey kid, can I talk to you for a second? Okay, get this. A little while ago, this girl came up and started talking to me. She had really tan skin, and she was really spirited. I'd say saucy, even. Wahoo! But the thing is, I think she might have thought I was someone else. I only had a chance to say, hey there, hello, then she disappeared. Well, the life of a dashing sea captain isn't always easy. That name is horrible. Which one? Gongoron? Gon... Gongoron? I mean, it only clicked that, uh, Biggeron is Big... Big Goron. Oh, she's here. Haha! -ha! 
I finally met the mermaid of my dreams. Never would I have dreamed the mermaid would come to me. You had a hand in this, young man, so I want to give you this. Oh, it's not a heart piece. You got the fishing rod. Tap fish from the menu while sailing to use it. I had that fishing rod made so I could hook the mythical mermaid, but I obviously don't need it anymore, so you can have it. Oh, but I have quite a challenge to stoke the fire of adventure in your heart. You must sail the seas, fishing for mighty catches like I did in my youth. While at sea, keep an eye for fish shadows. Go to where the fish are, then when you are above them, tap fish from the menu. And that's when the true romance of the sea will grip you. Oh, it's you. I found this old wayfarer, thanks to you. He's great, always raving about the romance of the sea and call of adventure. I'm going to pretend to be a mermaid for a bit and let him think I'm the real thing. Shh, it's our little secret. <laughs> a new game? No, it's the same one. What would make a mermaid desirable? Um, I don't know. I mean, I think the whole thing is, it's not so much that it's fish pussy, it's more just... I think the origins of the mermaid come from just m people that were at sea, and uh, of course loneliness settles in after a certain point, you know, not seeing someone you desire. And then, I forgot what animal it was, but they confused it with that, and that's where the, the, the tale comes from. But I mean, yeah, I don't, I don't know how it would work if you were to actually hook up with a mermaid. Because it, it would have to be like... Bottom half has to be human for it to work, but it's the other way around, so I don't know what you would even do. Just... Yeah. It's the boobs, that's it. Uh... I swear there was a heart from this, but maybe I'm thinking of another game. Or is it a, is it a reward of, uh... Of the fishing thing? I might have to check. One sec. Okay. Yeah, okay. It's... There is a heart piece with this, and it's the result of, uh... The entire fishing quest sideline. <laughs> I love- I love the sentences that you typed to confirm me. You're talking about- uh, you're talking about how how it would be to functionally hook up with a fish and then you're like oh no it's 7 a.m what am i doing talking about fish boobs at 7 a.m we're not running it's honest it's honestly just easier to do this So after the fishing thing, that just leaves one more heart piece somewhere. What's she doing? No better time to talk about the intricacy of intimacy with fish women. Jeez. What are you gonna say this time? You. You should really learn to give a girl a break, hear me?
Hey, did she look like she's getting a few pimples on her nose? Huh? How do I have time to notice stuff like that? I was in a crate. It was boring. Cut me some slack, huh? Anyway, let's clear out. I want to put these waters behind us as fast as I can. Oh, no reward this time? Okay, I guess we're done with rewards for this then. It's still easier to fight her than avoid her. Oh. <laughs> the fish are moving. I should not be surprised. Alright, do that. I think it was Futurama where there's an episode where one of the main characters tries to hook up with a mermaid and then they go into the whole thing where it just doesn't work. Like she just acts like a fish. Fry? Yeah, I thought so. She just does what a fish does. Okay, how does this work? Um, hold on. I should go classic DS for this. Okay, so it's your first time fishing, Lankles. I will teach you some of the secrets of fishing. Slide the stylus down the screen to pull your rod. To reel in, make small circles with the stylus. When you get a bite, lift up the rod to set the hook. Timing is key. You got a bite. The key to fishing is knowing when to pull up on your rod and reel in. If you don't do anything, the gauge at the top will drop fast. Make the gauge rise by sliding down the screen away from the fish. When the gauge is up, reel the fish in. The fish will jump. This one's tricky. When it jumps, take the stylus off the screen. This is probably the easiest fish, like I feel like it's being super lenient. Caught a Skippy Jack. Okay. Uh, because I'm lazy. <laughs> it's gonna save me like a minute. I just want to see what happens when I turn the fish in. Show me what you hold in, sure. Where is it? Let me see it. Hey now, did you think you could impress me with such a common fish? That's a bit presumptuous of you. True wayfarers have standards, you know. Okay, but it's a start. You gotta start somewhere. The 
Okay, I'll go back to that spot and see if the fish changes now. Okay. Yeah, it did move. I think this is all, all it's going to be, is just going to each of these spots and just catching the fish, then going to see him, and... Yeah. But it's for a heart container, so... I guess this is gonna be filler. I'll do a little bit of it, and then we'll go do some dungeon stuff, just so it doesn't get repetitive. Leave me alone. Uh-oh. <laughs> I almost shot Beetle. I am but a humble fisherman. Just trying to make a level living. This thing is moving pretty quickly. Okay, I think I'm directly on it now. Alright. Beesh. That was close. almost lost it. I think this is being very lenient. I mean, when you compare this to the archery minigame... I caught a tuna! Among more common varieties, it's pretty big. Okay. Back to the old man. <laughs> I'll do one more fish and then we'll go dungeon. What was that? <laughs> Just, they didn't dock correctly. Okay. Let's see what old man has to say about the tuna. 
You still haven't caught the big one, have you? The sea still hides many f prized fishes. All right, but I'm I'm heading up in the world. Hopefully we can catch up to this one right away. Okay, it looks like it's headed this way. I'm just assuming it's gonna follow that path. Ah, uh, go away. Yeah, run away. Okay. Okay, I think we're on it now. Okay, let's see how we go. Yeah, I'm letting it go. Greedy. What is it? It's another tuna. Alright, we're going to another ocean. Let's go. Oh, convenient. Alright. It might even come to me, we'll see. What is it doing? It's inside the rock. Okay, hang on. Be smart about this. <laughs> it's clearly headed in this direction. Stop. Oh, it's heading further down. That's annoying. Okay, I think I'm I think I'm over it. I think we got it. Alright.
I think it's the same thing again. Okay, we're going next C. Oh, this one's a lot further away. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I'll just set a random course and... Hey, hopefully it'll work. We'll see. Where's the enemy? Hmm, okay. There's gotta be a closer symbol to that side. changing the route now. I really don't like shocks. Oh no, this is gonna be problematic. Okay, hold on. I have an idea. We have to come here anyway. I think if I go here, it's going to reset the fish position. Plus, it'll give us a break from fishing and I can do something else. DS. Welcome to the game. That's all the rage. Yes, it's the Goron game. Want to take it for a spin? 50 rupees, brother. Alright. Thank you, let me explain the simple rules of the Goron game. There are several targets scattered about the course, brother. Break all of them and the final path to the finish line will open. Think efficiently and quickly, and most of all, think like a Goron and win. Did you get all that, brother? One more time. Targets. Break them all. Final path. Think efficiently. Okay. Sidekick. He'll be the one actually rolling around the course for you. Go for it. Ah, oh, cool, we got to do this again. I am the one and only star on this island. My fans call me Gongoron. What? Hold on. What are you doing here, Goro Lankles? We were wondering the same thing. I got a part-time job to help my dad make ends meet. I bet we'll be unstoppable with you rolling me around, Goro Lankles. The best time is 35 seconds, brother. Well... Let's get going. What are you doing? Think efficiently, how? Think efficiently, yeah. I've, I've, I've made an error. This is a bad choice. That was not good. The record is 35. Yeah, I mean, I made money, sure. <laughs> Alright, how do I do better? Uh, 
Oh, this corner. That corner messed me up. No, we're not doing that. Yep, this is this is worse. How did I mess up so badly? Dude, this has pocketed me money. <laughs> that that scale there, I think, is worth eight hundred for me. Oh my god. I was doing so well. I was doing so well! Still better, but probably not, not record pace. Oh! I got it. 33 seconds, a thrilling record, and you just set a new high. Please take away a thrilling prize. Nice. Um, no, that's it. That's all we get from there. Like, it's usually just one good item, and then the rest are kind of inconsequential. Unless there's one for 30 seconds, let me just check. It could be a heart piece. Uh... Goron game Phantom Hourglass. What are the prizes? Okay, yeah, it's just it's just the bomb bag. So we don't get anything else really worth it. But that went extremely well given I got a hundred rupees for the first prize and then something worth eight hundred for the second. Easy money. Okay, where's the fish? Go get the fish. Set sail for fish. Directly on top. All right. I can't tell what it is, but I don't think it's the same one as before. I think it's a small one again, eh. Yeah. Skippy Jack, yeah, yeah, not worth. Okay. Uh, we're heading to the North Sea now.
I'm just going to ignore the fish. <laughs> I'm sure it's fine. We got more fish here. Okay. Let's do this. The Isle of the Dead! I think we got to go fishing too. It looks like it's going to conveniently be in position. It seems to be stuck there, so that's that's great. We need the symbol. Okay. It is... what is it? It's... Seems easy. Alright. It's time to fish. early. Whoa, 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 whoa. What a worry impression. Oh yes, it's time to fish! Got to get the glorious fish. There you go. <laughs> I love that noise he makes. That's legitimately a noise Warrior makes. <laughs> Oh, no, it's a big one. Look at it. Oh, it's a tuna. Ugh. But, I mean, it's a larger one, so... Okay, well, we're continuing to the Isle of the Dead anyway. Okay. Guess we get to go fishing again. I, I mean, it's ra random's random. I just have to keep trying until. Until I get it. I mean, that's just all there is to it. It's swapping the the stream layout to this as well. Man, the DS was just so cool. I mean, when games did this, it was it was pretty awesome. This is, this is just a little one. I can already see it. I can just be quick about it. There's no finesse. It's just... 
Unfortunately, there's no way to tell what fish it's going to be. Okay. Isle of the Dead. Let's go. We'll try. Hopefully no more interruptions. I'm surprised I haven't come across a hidden island yet, though. There's usually one per map. I already did the island with the Anuki. Yeah, I did. Anuki. The imposter thing was pretty funny. We're up to the pyramids. Seems deserted for now, but this place wasn't always empty. I wonder if there's some secret hidden here somewhere. How about you, kid? What how, uh, what are you doing? Oh, I'll be fixing the ship. Go find yourself adventure on the island. I like the part where one of them rats out the fact that they all keep their treasure buried underneath the sign outside their house. So you just go around and just take everything. Look on top of that desk. There's a book there. The Journal of the Esteemed Explorer McNay. Normally on a map, up is north, down is south, right is east, left is west. But looking at a map, I discovered the secret of the island. This island is shaped like the profile of someone wearing a crown. Oh yeah, I can see it. He is looking east, but if you look closely, you can see his eye and mouth. I'm betting there is a big secret about the Cobble Kingdom here. I still haven't found the treasure that's supposed to be in this room. Am I robbing people straight out of their houses? Well, it's not in their house. It's outside buried. So. <laughs> it isn't robbing if you're the protagonist, no. I mean, if you've ever seen um, that movie Free Guy, where everyone's just an, an NPC and they just, you know, let stuff happen. Tomorrow, I'm planning to go to the temple on the northeastern corner. It's time to prove what I wrote in the Explorer's article for the compass. There's supposed to be some absurdly cryptic puzzle or trick here, but with my keen Explorer sense, I should have it solved before lunch. I'll find the Aquanine and show them all. Help! 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 Do you think the pure metal is on this island? Well, I think it's worth looking. There's a bunch of books around. Let's read them. Dude, please, just let me play the game. <laughs> I'm sorry, chat. Explorer's Compass riddle, riddle of the Lost Ancient Civilization. Volume 1, The Riddle of the Cobble Kingdom Civilization. In seas ruled by the Ocean King, the cultured Cobble Kingdom soared above all. It was more glorious than any other city until it vanished from history. Ruled by the King and his four knights, the temple once held a great treasure. Riddle of the Lost Ancient Civilization, Volume 2, Hidden Treasures, the Aquanine. Three great treasures are hidden around these seas. One is the Aquanine. Legend has a there is but one of each of these pure metals in this world. 
Legend also says that one of the pure metals is kept in the Cobble Kingdom. Explorers come, blah, 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 blah. Yep, volume three. Some say there is treasure in the Cobble Kingdom, but no one has seen the island. Only the ancient legend remains. Some say it is an island of dreams. Proof must be found on the Isle of the Dead to reach the Cobble Kingdom. In the area of ocean near the Cobble Kingdom, there is an uncharted isle. One is a common place. Oh, okay. Change format. Oh, my bad. I forgot to change back to that. Thank you. Okay. We doing we're doing this, are we? It looks like something's reanimating them. This is the part of the game that it's towards the end, so I don't really remember it as much. Ah! <laughs> oh no, it's hitting the tree. Okay, let's not waste arrows. Where are they getting the bones from to throw? Like, if they're getting them from their body, don't they run out of bones eventually? Don't they incapacitate themselves? After a certain point, you'd run out of bones to throw, you know? The sacred tree grows from the king's chin, west 13, north seven. Okay, so there's a tree here. It says W13. Oh, I can't, I can't read that. I hate, I hate that this doesn't have... <laughs> W thirteen and Okay. The path to the graveyard where six sages dwell hidden underground. Okay. The resting place of the fourth night. Phantom corridor again. Those without the way the six sages are doomed. Okay, don't go that way. Oh, it's like the sacred woods. Okay. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. One, two, three, 
That's four, five, six, seven. Okay, and just for future reference. Never know, might have to backtrack. One of these is fake. I'm I am not an idiot. This is one of these is one of these is the bait. was going to be sinister would have done it right away face west from the king's eye and shoot an arrow face west from the king's eye and shoot an arrow all right so we want to I'm going to use this as an opportunity as well, because these should respawn. Yeah. Get arrows. Because I was running a little bit low. Alright, that'll do. Oh, no. Okay. From the king's eye... Hey, Cookie, what's up? Oh, boy, is it? That is from the King's Eye, right? Like a... Or is it further on? Oh, oh, come on. It's not really the King's Eye. Treasure. Oh, yes. Okay, we'll be back. Going to the Uncharted Isle. Uh, that's what it's pointing out. This mug holds a lot more than I thought it would. I found, I found this old mug that was mine at work and I brought it home. <laughs> I used to use it, but it holds quite a bit. Woke up five minutes ago, nothing has happened, but pretty good five minutes. Ah. Well, bodes well for the rest of the day, doesn't it? We've been boarded by monsters! Yeah, 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 hurry up.
Do I get health from this? Yeah, there we go. May as well. Did they honestly think they could best us? Utter fools. Here's a tip for you. Yeah, for anyone wondering, it's like a... It's a, it's a ceramic Dota 2 mod, but it's like in the face of one of these characters. And it's pretty, pretty sturdy. It's not your average mod. In fact, I think if... If it was to... Collide with another mug, it would probably shatter it. <laughs> you mean? Where was the help? Island! Waited for us to hit the island to even say anything? <laughs> what? I've never seen that happen before. Usually it, when it's spotted from a distance, uh, What on earth is going on? <laughs> I looked away for a sec, and then there was just this island, and I couldn't turn away in, in time. Like, really? You're gonna let me collide with the island and then be like, HEY! Look, there's an island! Did you know that you- Whoa. Can I do this? Fascinating island, don't you think, kid? I love the open sea. There's always another surprise on the horizon, just waiting to be found. Welcome to the treasure maze. Shall we get started, or do you need to hear the rules? Rules. The goal is to whack my buddies with your sword before the time runs out. If you win, you can grab the treasure that appears after you hit them all. The maze has three levels of difficulty, which ramps up with each victory. Okay. Yeah. Beginner. Right. Here we go. Okay, we can take our time here to plot out the course now. Okay. Ooh, this is not as easy as I thought it would be. Oh, I got rid of him. Crap. I should have marked them. I kind of remember where they are. Uh oh. I may have screwed myself here. I don't remember where the last one is. That's a problem. Okay. 
I'm gonna lose this because I didn't mark it. Okay, I'm gonna do it again. I didn't know they were gonna disappear. Okay, same spots again. Okay, there's one here. Oops. Okay, so let's go. I'm going for the lower one first. Because now I can just backtrack, hopefully. And then it should be a piece of cake. No fast beeps, let's go. Oh no. I have to get to the treasure as well? Dude. Ooh, this is kind of brutal. Uh, okay. I'm gonna have to be better at this. Uh, I guess I'm underestimating how hard this is. So I can't just go, like, skip stuff. I have to make sure that I have a path back. I think I have to leave this one to last. Oh, it's not even the way across. Jeez. Oh, it is both. It is both. Okay. Yeah, but now... Wow, this sucks. Uh, okay. 
I'm gonna waste a lot of money here. Okay, I'm trying a different approach. I'm pretty sure I'm right. The bottom one just is a nice pathway. There's probably some efficient way to do this. Okay, that makes that nice and clear. Now here lies the problem. What what do? Oh no. Okay, this is going well. Okay, now, how do I get, how do I get up? Yeah. <laughs> I think I might have to open the floor to suggestions here, like the seams. Let's think strategy. Maybe I need to start marking things on the map. Okay. I also noticed that there were a couple of walls to bomb, but I didn't do it, but... Okay, let's try again. I think I need to actually plot out the path I'm going to take. This, I mean, it, it's definitely this one has to be first. Okay. I think this is definitely in our best interest here, doing both of these. So hold up. There's, look. I want to see if these persist. Also a spot here. It has to be. There's no other way in there. No? Okay. I'm 
Wow, this is this is fucked. I'm only just getting this now. Okay, uh, what I want to say is... That spot that I did... Yeah, it's a beginner level as well, right? Like, how crazy is that? It does remain open. Okay. So that's gonna cut some time. This is pretty much I have to find the spots where I can- I think that there's a bomb involved. This also slows you down quite a bit. Okay. I'm looking for any other spots that I feel like could cut things down. But when it's in motion, it's so hard to spot things out. just a gem. <laughs> uh, I mean, it does get harder, so I assume these rewards are better. Okay, let me look, let me look, look at this map. How else do you get that chest in there? Okay, anyway. Yes, your current level is normal. Oh boy. Okay. Uh, are they gonna change position? Let's see. Eight! Oh my god. Okay, let's erase the map. This just seems ridiculous. Okay, I have to mark them first. There. 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 Same ones as before. Okay. I don't think we can use the same strategy. So I think for this one, we have to go get the north one most first. Then come back down. And I think... That looks pretty normal. Okay. Hold on, I'm, I'm thinking. I think it's actually pretty similar to what I just did. Let's just, let me try. I hope you get more time for this. Just looking at it, it seems like I just have to take a couple of extra spots. And I can see where I need to do it. Oh no! This is already ruined. 
This is already ruined. I was supposed to jump across that. I guess I'm gonna try and get into that spot then. But yeah, looking at it, it seems almost identical. Which is nice, it's just... Yeah, I'm, I'm doing this now. I really don't like that this is a thing. It just slows you down so much. Anyway, um... Why is this... I'll find a way in there. There it is. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Is this the worst minigame? No, the archery one was way more strict. I actually lost my mind at the archery one, so I'm gonna use this as a scouting mission. I'm pretty sure it's the same circuit, I just have a couple of extra steps to make. So. I think I should be okay. It's just, ugh, I can't believe I messed up that first jump. Okay. I think I, I think I got it. <laughs> just don't mess up the jump. It's an expensive mistake. No. Ah. Oh, this has already screwed me over. We've got to have the bow out. We'll see. I love that it has the audacity to say this is normal difficulty. <laughs> this is pretty tricky. See what I mean? It's it's kind of the same. I'm doing this just in case. And then gotta come up here now. And then go back. This is the part where I'm like, is this correct? Because this is... I can't think of a way to improve this one. Okay, we're not up to emergency beeping, so that's good. Alright, that, they're all done. So stressful. <laughs> Got it. Okay. Yeah, alright, now it's the last difficulty. Expert. Okay. We're going to take a minute and we're going to think. Fort oh, Jeez. Okay. 
All right, I'm gonna have to number them, and I'm gonna have to like plan out a course chart. This might take like a minute. Okay, so they're more or less in the same spots as before. There's just extra positions I need to stop on. So go around the whole map, okay. Okay, hold on. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's look at this for a minute. Hold on. I'm putting this on the desk so I can look at this freely. Oh boy. Okay. Because it's a hundred rupees per attempt, so you know. I can't just wing it. Okay. Why is that one up high? I wish I could draw on this, like now. Okay, you know what? I, I, I have an idea. Give, give me a sec, give me a sec. We'll use a, a little a little bit of production value to plan my path. Uh, okay, I'll use Wario's head as a little indicator. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Let me shrink it down a little. Uh, and block all the other sources so I don't accidentally move stuff. Alright, cool. Okay, so this is me. Alright. So, let's see. Go up here. And then get this one first. I think that's a plus. And then I think what we have to do is go here now. So get that one. So kind of go... Bleh, get that. Go down. Ooh, but then this... Does, is this bridge still there? I think the bridge is there. So then we'd have to get this. Get across. Okay. So that's the left side handle. Then jump. Jump. There's one here. Hit it. Go across. Go in here. Get that one. Jump inwards. Get this one. And then I think this time we have to come up. Wait a minute. Wasn't there one in this corner? Oh, I think I missed one. I think there's one here as well. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Shit, there's one missing. Where did I? Where did I? Did I? I missed one. Where did I miss one? The top corner. But there's another one. There's one missing. What? One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Okay. I don't know where the other one is. There's I've I've missed the second one. Alright, well this is a throwaway, but my plan is go up here, then go here, get this, get this, get this. This, 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 this. Or maybe this, this, then up here, then down, then get this, and this. But see, the problem... ...becomes here, because this is blocked off. So now I'd have to hit the switch, then go up, then I can come back through here. And then come down. Oh, uh, I'm just gonna have to give it a trial run. Alright. This one's gonna be a throwaway, I guess, to see how bad it is. Okay. I'm ready. Let's go. This right here, this is so annoying. It shouldn't have missed. Oh, 
Oh no. This had better give me more time. I think this this opener is correct. No, so this is the ending, so go down. Okay, this is for our way back. Definitely not gonna get this right. <laughs> oh, yeah, right, there's this now. This is a lot longer. Is there one here? No, I'm wrong, but let's just... That doesn't help. Oh, this is, this is going to be tough. <laughs> this is going to be tough. Okay. Do this again. I think I'm going to take the same course as I did before because that just seemed like it took way too long. Okay, I got, I got my missing one. Having to swap out weapons just takes too long. Okay, we want to be ready to use this.
I think all of the I think all of this is the same now that I'm looking at it. It just seems basically identical. It's just a few extra stops. But the path is more or less the same every time. We'll see. To emergency beeps. Shit. <sighs> Thank you for the follow. I think that works. I just need to be quicker. I think I can do it. That worked. I just need to be quicker. Okay. There are a few things there that did not go to plan, so... The item switching aspect of it is, is the most clunky thing. What the fuck is this? That is the worst part of it, right there. I'm sorry, that that's just annoying. Because the camera didn't pan and it misses, really? I can see why you wouldn't want to beat this. try and get this on the other way because I feel like this is probably shorter if I do this. Ah! I just realized that I could have done that quicker. Alright, I know if I fail this I know where I can cut down some time. I think this is the same either way. We'll see. Okay, this is definitely quicker. I was already up to emergency beeps here. Oh shit. 
Run, 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 run. Ah! Oh, no! I tapped, I tapped it. <laughs> okay. Ah! It was because of the arrow. It straight up because of the arrow didn't land. That was the difference. Ah, right, all right, all right, all right. We're doing it this time. It's happening. Okay. Focus. Oh wait, didn't I pay? No, I didn't pay. Oh, I did. Why isn't it not? Tap. Tap. What the fuck? Okay, that was weird. It doesn't do tap strike on it. I can't skip this, but okay. Alright. A little bit better, a little bit better. Still not ideal, but better. swap already just buy myself some time here then there's less panic when I get up to that part this is the part where I've definitely improved now Just the thought I had. Another improvement. I'll be shocked if I don't get this, because this has been really clean so far. Aside from the first arrow. Yes! <laughs> okay. Oh, that was tough. Yeah, thanks for the GG. Hey, I'm impressed. You're the first one to beat the treasure maze. Your name will be carved in the Hall of Fame tablet, and I present you with a gift in honor of this occasion. Please accept the contents of that treasure chest. So, I mean, a, almost a refund. So I guess it just leaves the fishing one and then we're good. 
Am I gonna 100% it? Uh, just in the sense of getting the heart containers. I don't think I'm gonna do the gem thing. Because they're really mm, of not much consequence. Or the ship parts. The ship parts just take too long. For me, it's getting all the heart containers. That's the main thing. And then sometimes if the collectible is not too annoying, I'll do it. Like the ghosts in Twilight Princess, that was fine. I've played this game before. When it first when it first came out, yes. When it first came out, yes. It's been a long time, so. Huh. I thought there was going to be something here, but I guess not. I'll salvage just in case, but I don't think this is anything important. There's no avoiding that one. I mean, to be honest, I'm not going to be really doing much salvaging. It's just ship parts, mainly. Should have just done that. There we go. Hey, hey, Jeffrey. Yeah, I'm up to Phantom Hourglass, so... For those that don't know, I'm playing through every Zelda game until... Tears of the Kingdom comes out, so... After this, I believe there's five left. I guess go back to this island. never finished Ocarina of Time because he got lost in the water temple. But yeah, that temple is a headache. The only Zelda game that I didn't finish right away, like as a kid, was the original, and that's... I did finish it eventually when I was a teenager. Am I playing them in timeline or release? Uh, release date, because timeline order just gets too messy. Um, because I'm playing these on real hardware, so like, if I was playing them in timeline order, I'd have to get a console out, put it away, then get it out again later because we're going back in time, so... At least this way, I'm moving along in terms of consoles, and then when I'm done with it, the console gets put to the side. Spirit Track, Skyward Sword, Link Between Worlds, uh, Triforce Heroes, then Breath of the Wild, I believe is the order.
Though I already did play Skyward Sword, so I'm not sure if I'm gonna play it again, but... Because there's not much time left until the game releases. And Breath of the Wild is really long. I wanted to be in the position where I was playing Breath of the Wild right before Tears released. Ah, don't worry about that. It's not important. Oh, I'm gonna have to go all the way around again. I think I'm right. Hang on, let me see. Um, the only one I didn't play because I don't have a copy of it and it's kind of a pain to play is, uh, buh, 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 buh. which one is it? I'm trying to find that list that I had. Yeah, the only one I did not play was Four Swords Adventures, which is the GameCube one that required... A Game Boy Advance in order to play. Finding a copy of it is expensive, and even then you still need a Game Boy Advance to play it properly, so... That's the only one I skipped, because it's pretty difficult to play that one. It doesn't really have that much of a big story anyway, so I think it's fine. But let's see, after... After this, Spirit Tracks, Skyward Sword, Link Between Worlds, Triforce Heroes then Breath of the Wild, so I did get it right. Did I play the Game Boy games? Hell yeah. <laughs> As a bonus, I also played the, uh, the enhanced version of Zelda 2, which is something that's been doing the rounds lately. Uh, for those that don't know, a, it's a fan-made project. One guy took the source code for Zelda 2 and put it in a game engine for PC. And then just basically cleaned up a bunch of stuff and made the game more like the other ones. It still has Zelda 2 graphics. It still plays like Zelda 2. But it just has a bunch of quality of life stuff and things that just make it better. So that was a bonus that I also played along with this. That was a lot of fun. Oh, right. Forgot about this. a game over. Here rest six sages to whom the temple is known. Those who do not know will never pass the Phantom Corridor. of the clues on the island.
Ups. Ah. <laughs> what? Like, I thought that map was gonna take me to the next part of this, so that was my bad. <laughs> okay. So, I, I have the hole where it wanted me to go. The rest of this. Okay, let me have a look. Let's see if there's any other stone tablets. I'll see what this has to say. Again. The resting place of the fourth night brant of the Cobble Kingdom. Hmm. All that right one did was... Unless it was on the cliff and I just didn't see it. It did kind of get up there and then drop quickly. this room to heal. <laughs> and replenish all those arrows I lost on that maze. I really do hope that Whatever tears may have, it brings dungeons back. I don't know if they can get away with doing 900 Koroks and the same thing again. Like, I, I would love it if it was what Breath of the Wild had, but then more areas like Hyrule Castle. Just something gigantic that's a dungeon would be awesome. They still haven't really shown much about the game, and it's still like a month away. Well, a month and a half, but... I'm kind of surprised. Yeah, there's nothing here, it's just a chest. Hmm. I mean, I could just start pushing stuff around. When in doubt, just start pushing stuff. Ah, oh, I am the fourth sage. Okay. Here we go. People will buy it anyway. No, I mean, of course, people will still buy it. It's, it's not even marketing. It's just typically they do show it. And they do care about marketing. Because here's the thing, like... Zelda is not as universal as a game as you would think. Like, the fan base, we all live in this bubble, and then when someone says they haven't played a Zelda game before, we're like, what? How have you never played Zelda? But the thing is, it exists, so that's what they market to, is like... There's a lot of people that got into Zelda with Tears of... Uh, not Tears of the Kingdom, with Breath of the Wild. And I imagine they'll probably be marketing the crap out of it. So I think they do care. 
I don't think they care about the hardcore fans when it comes to marketing, because of course that we're going to buy it anyway, right? <laughs> I, I've been wanting to play this game pretty much since I finished the, the other one. But yeah, I, I know quite a few people that play a lot of games and they haven't played Zelda or don't like it, believe it or not. Okay, so it says go up. And this is number four. Second Sage, okay, two. Go like that. Okay, which means you should be the first. It's either... Well, this one could be the first sage, let's see. Most of the words, okay, so this is first sage. No? Can't read it from here. Third sage, go east. Where is number one? Six Sage. Okay, so this is six. Fifth. How is it not that? Okay, there we go. First Sage. Which I guess I don't have to mark it. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Oh, their instructions. Duh. Okay, up, up, right, right, up, up. For some reason, I thought a door was going to appear, but no, it's it's instructions for the Lost Woods type maze here. Up, right, right, up, up. Up. Right. Right. Up. And up. This is where the dead of the Cobble Kingdom, long ago fallen, lay at rest. I am one of the four knights chosen by the king. I am the fourth knight, Brant. Those spirits you have with you, they are power, wisdom, and courage, yes? Why are the three spirits of the Ocean King with you? I can't believe what has happened to the Ocean King while we slept. So that is why you are looking for the Aquanine. We grew rich under the Ocean King's protection. We must do something. I believe that our King Muto has the Aquanine you are looking for. If you explain your quest, you may convince him to give it to you. Venture forth through the door. The Regal Necklace. This mysterious necklace is adorned with curious gems. King Muto, the holder of the Aquanine, is not here. He is on the island that is guarded by a rock wall, the Isle of Ruins. You'll need a Regal Necklace to get there. That will calm the cyclone at the entrance so that your boat may pass. 
hit uh, there. Look for the third night Bremer. Got it? Yep. So I guess I can just drop down here. Okay, cool. Farewell, I love the dead. I've been playing this for five hours, chat. <laughs> uh, you know what? Because I am lazy. I'm surprised I recognized that. Okay, cool. Go have a little bit of fishing and then in the. If the end result of the fishing quest wasn't a heart, I would uh I would leave it, but unfortunately it's a heart, so it must be done. Oh no, the fish has gone away. Three sharks? They really don't want me to go in here. Alright, I think I should just go through the cyclone. Wait a minute. The fish is going to hit a wall and then come back. I think, I think that's right. Let's just... Trust. Is it going up? No, it's going up. <laughs> That's gonna take too long. Okay, leave it. I thought if it came back, then it'd be fine, but no, it's, it's heading up. I'm just... I'm not gonna chase her and then go back down. What? Did you see that kid? That cyclone, it just vanished. I guess that story about the necklace opening the way was true after all. Fish is watching the stream and escaping. Oh, uh, stream sniping, huh? What a weirdly shaped island. This can't be natural. I think it's safe to say this is the Cobble Kingdom. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I saw this map. And I'll, I was debating whether or not I should keep going. Based on what I'm seeing here, this looks like it's going to take a while. And it is approaching midnight here. Pretty much two minutes away. So, I do have work tomorrow, chat. And I do have to get up early. Earlier than usual. So, I'm going to have to leave it here. But we will wrap this up tomorrow for sure. So, I hope you join me for that. And... Since I'm done with Vampire Survivors and Metroid, I guess I'll I'll find something else to also play alongside this. But that'll be the plan. I'll, I'll do more of this tomorrow. And, uh, yeah, we'll finish it up. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Thank you for tuning in, everyone. Especially if you're new, appreciate you popping in to check the content. If you want to watch more of my content, you can find me on YouTube. Just search for the channel name over there and... I have three channels you can check out with a mix of VODs, highlights, and the occasional YouTube stream. If you want to see me play more Zelda games, or I think... What is what is it up to? I think it's uploaded uh, the Oracle games, I think, were the last ones that were published. So, yeah. Hope you do check that out. And YouTubers, if you're watching this later, thanks for tuning in. Appreciate you clicking and staying to the end. 
All right, I'm gonna stop talking, everyone. I'm gonna go get some sleep. And yeah, we shall continue this tomorrow. So enjoy the rest of your day. Thanks for tuning in.